Hello lovely people, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the Smiling Man. Yeah. So this is a remake of an older game. I'm gonna sneeze. Am I gonna sneeze? Yes! Achoo! This game contains jump scares, contains jump scares, loud noises, blood, violence, and gore. Oh, good. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I appreciate the warning. Use headphones, turn up the volume, play in the dark. Should I close my curtains? I'll close my curtains. Just for... Just for... Just, just for them. Just for yeah, this is a... Oh, God. <laughs> Hello? Is that the smiling man? It's over, we did it, we found him! <laughs> yeah, this is a remake of an earlier game called... The Smiling Man. Press enter to start the game! I'd love to! Good, it works. So apparently... Yeah, so they have this main story which is... The original game? Or is based on the original game? And then their alternate story is a new, longer version with three different endings. So I guess we should do the main story first, because I haven't played the original. I love the loading icon. This is very nicely made. This is nicely put together. I like this. I'm liking the... it's like a... synthwave vibe to the music. Diego Victor. Good job. This is that. This is like cinema cuts... uh, credits. Good job, El Elberly Lodro. Blue Tidal. Blue Tidal. I think is the original creator of The Smiling Man. Inspired by the short horror film by Michael Evans. Well done, Michael Evans. AI made by Sven. <laughs> Look at your smiling man go. I don't like this. <laughs> I already hate this. Why have I done this? What's wrong with me? I feel like obligated in Halloween. Special thanks. But we did. We haven't done it yet. Feels like it's a bit early for special thanks. It feels like, it feels like maybe this should come at the end. Well, cheers everyone. Oh, Markiplier must have played this. Some years ago, I lived in the center of a large... Some years ago, <laughs> I lived in the center of a large city in the USA. As I have always been a night person, I often got... I often got bored after my roommate, who was decidedly not a night person, went to bed. To pass the time, I used to take long walks and spend time thinking. I think I've read The Smiling Man. I might even done it, have done it in a crappy pasta. I spent four years like that, walking alone at night, and never once had a reason to feel afraid. I always used to joke that with my roommate that even the drug dealers in the city were polite. But all of that changed in just a few minutes of one evening. It was a Wednesday, somewhere between 1 and 2 in the morning, and I was walking near a police patrol park quite a ways from my apartment. It was a quiet night, even for a weeknight, with very little traffic and almost no one on foot. The park, as it was most nights, was completely empty. This was definitely written by a man. I don't care how safe your area is, <laughs> women aren't walking alone at night, not 2am. Oh, this is horrid. <laughs> don't you have video games? I guess sometimes I get a bit restless and I fancy a walk, but like... 2am walk in the park? I mean, my Tamagotchi would be asleep, so there's no point... <laughs> What's the point going for a walk if I'm not exercising my Tamagotchi? It's a Wednesday at 2 a.m. and I'm walking in the park. I am very coldy all of a sudden, I think, because I opened the window and I have hay fever. After a long time of walking. <laughs> 2 a 3 a.m. <laughs> Shit, it felt like longer. This is a boring park. It's been a long time. I'm tired. I better go home. I'm, like, floating through the park. I 
I don't like this. It's a car, it's a car. That's good. Sign of other people. All good, all good, all good. <laughs> it's a nice quiet- I was walking down a small street to get back to my apartment when I first noticed it. At the end of the street there was the silhouette of a man dancing. Is there? If there's a man dancing, I don't see him. Oh! It was a strange dance. As he danced, he took a step forward. I guess you could say he was dancing, coming straight toward me. He had really weird fingers. <laughs> really pointy, jagged fingers. That is an unusual dance for sure. That would catch my attention. He's probably drunk. He danced closer still until I could make out his face. His eyes were open wide and wild. Really? All I can see is black. Head tilted back slightly, looking off at the sky. His mouth was formed in a painfully wide cartoon of a smile. Hello. Uh, hello. He's happy. Haha. <laughs> I took my eyes off him to cross the empty street. Sir? Who? He had stopped dancing and was standing with one foot in the street, perfectly parallel to me. He was facing me, but still looking skyward. Smile still wide on his lips. Ha ha ha. Hey. Nice night. i see you later. Let me go home. Maybe cook some instant noodles. What a weird guy. Still, no harm done. No. Sir? He had crossed the street and was now crouching slightly. I was so shocked that I just stood there for a while looking at him. Seeing some kind of like a superhero fall pose. Sir? He's got his fists clenched. He took a giant, exaggerated steps on tiptoe like a cartoon character sneaking up on someone. Only he was moving very, very fast. Huh! Ah! La la! Uh. Hey! What's up? You okay? What the fuck do you want? I said. <laughs> hey. Oh, he's leaving. He just farts. He bends over and does a big fart at me. La la la! Bye! What a nice man. Welp. Time to go home. Uh, oh shit. <laughs> I think he's coming after me. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Scared the fuck out of me. Ow! Ow! He's hurting me! <laughs> he slapped me! I died! Oh no, do I have to listen to all the dialogue if I play it again? Oh no. Oh, that scared me so bad. That scared me really, really bad. <sighs> I think when I turned around to see if he was near me, I panicked <laughs> and I ended up running back the way I came. That was my mistake. I was walking down a small street, blah, blah, blah. 
Skip to the end. There was a man dancing. He had the moves like Mick Jagger. Who's Dick Jagger? It was weird. He was a weird guy. Just like an after my time I got you while I wait for these scenes. He danced closer still. Why don't you play with some uh some building blocks? Why is he playing hard to get anyway? Why does he keep running up to me and then going away and then coming back? Yeah, empty street, empty street, nothing there. And he's crouching. I was so shocked that I just stood there, like an idiot. What the fuck do you want? What do you want, mate? You looking for a fight? Come and have a go if you think you're old enough. Maybe I shouldn't say that. Right, this time, don't turn around. He's engaged sprint mode, here we go. Where do I live? I hope it's not far. Don't turn around, 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 don't turn around. Don't turn around, don't turn around. Just don't turn around. Just don't turn around, don't turn around. Don't turn around. It's very dark. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. I ran until I got off the side road and back onto a well-lit, low-traffic road. When I looked back, he was nowhere to be found. Throughout the rest of the way home, I kept looking over my shoulder, always expecting to see his stupid smile, but he was never there. I lived in that city for six months after that night and never went out for a night stroll again. There was something about his face that haunted me. He didn't look drunk, he didn't look high. He looked completely and utterly insane. And that's a very, very scary thing to see. <laughs> what a tale. What a story. So that's the original Smiling Man. If I hadn't fucked up so badly the first time, I think I would have gotten away with not getting scared. Alas. I scared myself to high heaven. So let's hope that I can get away with it in the alternate versions. I wonder how they've, like, how they've come up with the alternate endings. You're very welcome. Thank you for making the game. Play alternate story. Let's fucking go. I hope it doesn't start off the same. If I have to read those bits again, I'll be very sad. I went to the market to buy something to eat. I do this a few times a week, not only to purchase food, but also to appreciate the nighttime tranquility. But this time was different. I came face to face with evil in its most sinister form. A tall man, smiling and radiating a terrifying energy. I left a bit later than usual that night. It was 2 a.m. After that night, I never went out again at that hour. So I am going to get instant noodles. <gasps> I knew it. Run, interact, look at the object- there's objectives in this version. Objective. Don't die. Go to the market. Hey. This is to be my house. Where is the market? Okay. Is it this way? Nope. Is it this way? Hope it's not far to the market. Boy, I sure do love that nighttime tranquility. It is peaceful and relaxing. There's a guy there. Well, whatever, I'm going to the market, so... Maybe you're going to the market too, sir? You on your way back? Well, where is the market? 
Please be close, Market. I'm scared. I'm so scared. It's very dark. I don't want to turn around. I'm too scared. Just keep moving forward. I should have a torch or something if I'm going out in this kind of dark at night. Mark it. Okay, seems quiet. Quick, Mark! Hello. Ah, that guy looks tired. He looks really ready for a nap. Um, what do I want? I want some instant noodles, ideally. I cut, this is all just sort of JPEGs, so... Oops! Healthy shopping. Oh, snack shopping. Microwave popcorn. Barbecue! Um, I... I'm gonna buy yogurt. Yeah? Okay, I guess I'm buying all the healthy things. All the healthy snacks. Hello, sir. Good evening, it was 22.50. Thanks. I wonder if what I chose to buy affects anything. <laughs> well, time to go home. Nothing spooky going on now. Let's just run home. I got my healthy food shop. I got my yoghurt. Go home, eat your yoghurt, go to bed. I'm sure nothing weird or sinister will happen on the way. <laughs> oh, what a beautiful night. He's going to be stood in the same place he was before. I have a feeling he was there, actually, so maybe not. There's the graffiti spot. Oh, I'm so scared. <laughs> Where do I live? Holy shit! Holy shit, bro! What the fuck, man? This is my house, I think. You can't just be... You can't just be in my front lawn. Oh my god, my heart. The next night. <laughs> I don't think I can take the next night. I don't know if I can do it. Oh, why do I go to the market every night? I wouldn't be going to the market tonight if I had seen a man in my garden that scary the night before. Okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine. This is some fucking prankster having a laugh, having a really good laugh, that's why he's smiling so much. Oh. Hi. I'm singing in the rain, just singing in the rain. Here he comes. Here he comes. What a glorious feeling. I'm smiling again. <laughs> hey, nice night. And then he goes. Can I go home? Do I have to keep going to the shop? I really don't want to go to the market right now. I want to go home and lock the door. Why am I looking down at the floor? That's not what I would do. I'd be fucking legging it home, bolting the door. Oh, I'm very stiff and nervous. My mission is still to go to the market, so brilliant. Survival! <laughs> 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 
feel like survive or die is kind of uh, a given. I died. I did not survive. I chose die. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, one more time. I hope it starts me from the second night again. And not the beginning. Okay, I think it started me from back the same place. What's happening? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Is what's happening? Oh, it started me from here. Okay, good. That's a nice bit. I can hear him coming. I don't like it. I'm just trying to go to the market and buy a snack. It's nice that he plays music to let you know where he is. I hate it! Mark it! <gasps> Sir? Holy shit! That psycho killed him! How am I going to get my snacks now? Bad ending! <laughs> Why did I get the bad ending? Is it because I bought healthy snacks? That was the only choice I made! Is it because I wanted yoghurt? Is that why I got the bad ending? That hurts my feelings. What the fuck, man? Well, I mean, thank you, but... But my, my ending was bad. My bad ending. Is it just the, f the food? Is it where you choose to run? Is it because I ran to the market instead of running home? But I did get murdered when I tried to run home. My heart can't take any more right now, so for the moment, let's just live with having the bad ending. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. I hope you're having a good spooky season. I'll see you very soon.